This is AACPS Digest with Monika Monk. Hello and welcome to the Anne Arundel County Public Schools Digest, bringing you news about the people and programs of Anne Arundel County Public Schools. Enjoy the school year. Yeah, have some fun. Anne Arundel County Public Schools continues to welcome more and more students every school year. Again, in record fashion, more than 80,000 students. And welcome to Suburban Park High School were eagerly welcomed back to awesome by teachers and administrators and in some cases Board of Education members, elected officials and Superintendent of Schools George Arlotto who were all equally excited to see the students and reflect on how special the first day of school actually is. For me it's my daughter's senior year so we're really excited just to get back in the swing of things and have everybody ready for a back to awesome year. Education is the most important responsibility of local government. We spend 51% of our entire budget on pre-K through 12 education. So it is a major priority for our county and I wanted to be here today on the first day of school to wish these kids well on their first day back. Kids are probably nervous. I'm sitting here looking at all these freshmen getting ready to start their first day of high school and uh, looking forward to, to the start of classes and all of the great things that come with going to high school and uh, just excited for them and for the families. One. Two, three. The day was even more special at Lothian Elementary School, where they not only ushered in a new school year, but a brand new building. This school was built for them, and with this new facility, they truly have the potential to reach their goals and dreams for the future. This is a very significant day in the history of Lothian Elementary as we take pride in our new kingdom. When you walk into the building today, I hope you will be impressed and inspired by the increased space and extensive technology that this new $31.7 million facility has to offer. With an almost 60 year legacy of a strong school community, it is so gratifying to stand here with you today as we look forward to upholding the great traditions of strong families and achievement at Lothian. You are all so deserving of this moment. Crofton and Mills Parole Elementary Schools will also be celebrating major construction completions in late September. Dr. Arlotto also revealed that important initiatives have been expanded this year. We are not only, as Ms. Brown said, reopening the new Lothian, but we're starting the year with a brand new program where we're going to enhance elementary excellence and we're starting with the Global Studies program. We are delighted to bring that to Lothian in the Southern Cluster. We really think this is a way to better engage, to more engage through project-based learning and global studies our students here at Lothian. We're very excited about that. Just before the new school year got underway, the AACPS Office of World and Classical Languages helps students maintain a learning attitude through Global Language Camp. We run the language camp so that students get an opportunity to have some exposure to language before they go back to school in the fall and to get some just general interest in some of the different cultures and languages that are out there in the world so we can give kids a little bit of experience and a little bit of exposure to something other than what they know. Well, all the re research has shown that the earliest kids learn a language, the better. It not only improves their language ability, but also across the board in other disciplines that it improves their uh, learning in, in every content area. In its eighth year, the program now serves hundreds of fourth through sixth graders, immersing them into Chinese, French, Italian, and Spanish culture, language, and customs. I decided to send my child to the language camp because I think that it's important for him to be diverse and not only know English but other languages as well. I heard they were doing French and I want to go to Paris someday. I had fun at the summer camp because I went to Washington DC and I got to see all the paintings. I would say to my friends that they should come here because it was a wonderful experience. It is important to learn Chinese because for, for me, I wanted to go to I want to be an inventor and if you want to be an inventor you have to have products. Most products are um, from China and I wanted to get from here, I wanted to get my product from China so I would need to know how to speak Chinese to do that. The two-week camp held at Mead Middle School exposes students to familiar and not so familiar experiences of how young people live in other areas of the world providing more than 100 hours worth of global understanding and cultural awareness lessons. Thanks for watching the AACPS Digest on AACPS TV.